Um, he needs to be very family oriented because I am. I want kids. I want to be family. Um, I want holidays together, birthdays, family dinners every night, vacations, all that. I want all that. Because I grew up with that and I saw how important that was, like, building the structure of a woman. So that's what I really what I want. Um, what else? He. Now, listen, I used to be real picky <laughs> and I still am with, like, appearance because it's like, okay, straight, don't be so shallow. But, like, for me to marry you, I have to be attracted to you. Mm -hmm. Physically, mentally, emotionally, everything. So you don't have to be the most um, attractive man in the world. You don't have to be Michael Jordan, but like, or Michael B. Jordan. Michael Jordan. Michael B. Jordan. Oh, Michael B. Jordan. Oh, Stop. Oh. But you gotta be attractive. You have to like take care of your body, health, like be healthy, or like be trying to be healthy. So whether that's working out, you whether you take walks, like you gotta be doing something physically active because I'm physically active. So like, I need my male partner partner to be as well. He has to be loving, caring, genuine, a very thoughtful, a very thoughtful person. I love surprises. I love when people surprise me. Um, he has to love the travel because I do. Mm -hmm. What else? Very supportive. And I want him to be able to like teach me things like. I feel like a real man can like boss you up, not even necessarily boss you up like you need help, but like he should be able to give you wisdom and like y'all talk about different business ventures. Yeah. And just stuff like that, rather than just being so like service level. I agree. Tell him. He gotta be kind of funny too. Like he gotta have a sense of humor. That's a big one. I don't like too six serious people that should want y'all to be working out too. We he wanna get mad all the time easy. Ooh, throw you away. Oh my god. Yeah, you gotta work out. You want me to be a straight man? You have to work out. You have to be a gym. I need muscles. I need you not to struggle when you pick me up. I, you, for me, you don't gotta be going to the gym, but you gotta be able to pick me up. I'm a big girl. Why you don't want to go to the gym? Does that mean to his 50s or 40s? I'm not saying. He, he could start having health problems because he don't work out. I'm not saying it. that I wouldn't want you to go to the gym. I'm saying it's not like a. It's not like a. I'm not in it. Won't talk to you if you don't. I'm so rude. We didn't even show y'all our food for up close. Yeah, I was hungry. <laughs> <coughs> we suck. I went on charade all day, per usual. But I called her and she wasn't even ready. So then I took my time. And then she won't call me where she be. She was out. Up. She was out here before the car. <laughs> I was going to skit on Instagram. I was going to the car. So, mm. we just got in. We gonna get our nails in tomorrow? Did you go meal time? Ooh, we got Not too much. Not three much. Y'all, Lauren has a, what do you, do you call it, body sculpting? Mm -hmm. Lauren has a body sculpting business. Mm -hmm. It's called Physique, but tell how it's spelled. P-H-S-E-Q-U-E. <laughs> no, 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 think about it. Ah. Yes, I did. Um, so listen, if you come, get my stomach right and tight. If you come and you say, you know, Sheree, or you see Sheree on YouTube, I will give you 30% off. Or well, $30 off. I'm sorry, not 30%. Well, that's better, but $30 off. Uh, that's still good. Mm-hmm. Period. So if you in Atlanta and you're watching this, you want to get body sculpted, Tell Lauren I sent you. I'll have her Instagram and stuff linked below on like her business mm. page. Huh? Oh, what about your dream job, career? What do you see yourself doing in the next three to four years? I will tell you guys that answer when my big announcement comes. Ooh. Okay, yeah, we might like that. when it's in the works, like already like in pursuit, then I will tell you guys, but it's like too soon right now. Okay. Because I got you know. We like to hear that. Book them busy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't play with her. Funny. Do you do you want to stay in Atlanta? Huh? Or do you want to move? I've been thinking so, about moving, you guys. Like I really think I've been thinking about moving to like Texas, Florida, and just like, cause why not? Why, why not live in another place? I'm young. I have no kids. Me and my sister, we have discussed moving to Houston. Mm -hmm. Home. If things work out, right? It's possible. 
Oh, wow. Peace out, Atlanta. <laughs> Peace out, Atlanta. Don't get me wrong, y'all. Atlanta is like Atlanta's number one great. black entrepreneurship place. I get it. It is. But it's at the same time, it's, it's very fast paced. It's very oversaturated. It's very oversaturated and it's very fast paced. Like, it's hard to catch but up so with is, yourself. So is Houston. They say Houston's just a bigger Atlanta. But they say it's a little bit slower. Like, no, I have, not heard that at all. I have not heard that at all. I heard it's lit and if not more. Really? Like, you know how our clubs. It's a little on the weekends, but like the weekdays is pretty chill. Like, yeah, there's some spots that are cool. The Houston, I heard every day of the week is somewhere lit. Like, every day of the week. <coughs> See, that spice got you. <laughs> you want to laugh at me? Uh huh. I know you both are crying. <laughs> Y'all, the white spot just fell on a tripod. Probably because the angle. Yeah, it is. I mean, How am I supposed to eat this big part? You crack it, get a crack it open. Oh my mouth? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll show you. Do I have hands for you for real? Everybody's making Instagram and everything too complicated these days. <laughs> you gotta get all the juice, okay? Lauren a freak, y'all didn't know? She a freak. She Ooh, I'm about to hope you sound. Alright you guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed our first mukbang together. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow us on Instagram. I'll put our Instagram names on here and I'll also put our TikTok names in the description box. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye y'all. Bye guys. <laughs>